Welcome to another episode of Air Guns and Pesting Channel. I just received this uh, from Amazon. It's a Splatterverse target stand, all made in some type of plastic polymer. Uh, very nice uh, setup. You can it'll hold uh, from six to twenty-four inch targets. You can see the slots down here. You give an Allen wrench, three nuts, and three Allen bolts. You just basically put it together. Like I said, it's, it's uh, some kind of polymer. You use a uh, one by two by eight. That's what I use. That's what I picked up at the hardware store, at the lumber yard, I mean. Uh, fur strips, and I just cut it into uh, the one eight foot into a uh, two four foot sections. And then of course, you know, I just attached it to the fur strips. And this target that's on there, I actually was using it to uh, do some accuracy testing on a Wildcat and a Gamma Urban out to 50 yards. And I really like this because uh, it's very lightweight. You can buy some staking uh, spikes if you want, because there's, there's some holes right here, you, you know, to anchor in the ground if you want, or right here. But what I did was, uh, I just, while I was at the lumber yard, I just went ahead and picked up a, a brick and I just put it, laid it across and that held it in place, you know, uh, so it doesn't tip over. That was, for me, that was the easiest way to do it. Just throw a, a brick on there. This is made in America. Not made in China, but made in America. And it's made by Spiderverse. And it was under, uh, it was under $48 for this uh, Target stand. It's, it's really nice. Like I said, just get the uh, one by two by eight first strips and cut it down the way you want it and mount your target and you got a, a nice target stand to uh, do some plinking or accuracy testing like what I did. Very nice, we put together. Uh, give a shout out to uh, Casey, Carrie, excuse me, Carrie, and for uh, shooting uh, or shipping this out to me. And I'm glad he did because uh, I'm tired of using those uh, election signs, laugh out loud, that you know, that you find during uh, election time. They work great in the summertime, you know, because the ground's not frozen. But when the ground is uh, frozen, well, you can't stick those uh, election signs in the ground. So you got to come up with something alternative. And this is a, a very viable alternative to use summer or winter. There you go, folks. Sharing is caring. Stay safe. She's straight. May you pellet or slug. Hit his target, and we'll see you on the next episode of Air Guns and Pesting Channel. See ya!